Beloved, I call your spirit to attention, and spirit, I invite you to join me today in yet another celebration of how God has designed you. Spirit, I celebrate the fact that God designed you to commune with him in a different language than the soul uses. Each of our souls learns the language of our culture, or perhaps multiple languages, yet none of the languages of the soul cultures are able to truly grasp the nature of God. You are given different software. You're given different language. You, Spirit, are able to commune with God without the words of the soul. You're able to hear from God, speak to God. You're able to just be with God, exchanging data without exchanging words because you are spirit, because you're made of the same essence that God is made of. And I delight in celebrating with you the fact that the body needing sleep does not hamper your communing with God. In fact, you are often able to commune better with God at night than during the day with all the chatter from the soul. I remind you of Paul's statement after he came back from heaven. He says, eye has not seen, ear has not heard, and the mind of man can't imagine what heaven is like. The soul has limitations. The software just doesn't run the language of heaven, but you do. You do. And I celebrate with you that you are able to commune with God on a deeper level, a more profound level, an extraordinary level, a level that the soul will never reach. I celebrate you and I bless your communing that you would be able to unpack more and more of your original software to be able to have deeper and deeper connectedness, intimacy, communing, dialogue with the Most High God. I bless you, Spirit, in Jesus' name.